today I'm going to be the world's worst cheerleading coach. Squeeze tighter! Because a few weeks ago, my cheerleading coach embarrassed me at practice. And to make things worse, Adriana was really strict on me in my last competition. It's literally not straight. It is straight. What do you mean straight? My leg is straight. Look. That has an angle. So to get my revenge, I'm putting them through the most intense cheer practice of their life. Try harder. If they can survive till the end of class, they will win a mystery prize. This is Charlie and Alexa, and we're at their cheerleading gym in Wellington, Florida. I'm gonna let y'all in on something. So I'm gonna be super strict to Adriana and John Michael, but not you two. So since y'all are in on the prank, y'all cannot laugh at any point when I'm yelling at them, okay? Let's do this. Boom. Hurry up! You guys are late, let's go! Uh, yeah, you are. And what are you doing on your phone? Get off your phone. No, no that's phone. my phone. Dude, as soon as you step on the floor, you're in practice. All Put right. the phone down. Okay, I'm sorry. And where's your cheer shoes? I don't know. I didn't think I needed them. At my last cheer practice, John Michael gave me the most intense conditioning, so it's time for some payback. You know the consequences for when you forget your cheer shoes. No, I don't. Never forget your shoes! Okay, I'm sorry! I'll keep going! I'm sorry! Harder! Straighten your arms! Okay, I'm sorry! Put on the shoes! Woo! Oh. Yeah, hurry up! And your socks down. smell! Put them on fast! Let's go! Practice is starting! Look, a few weeks ago, I went a little crazy on Shark at the practice. I don't think I've ever seen him this strict before. Is he okay? This is my first time taking a cheer class, and if the shark isn't in a good mood, that's not going to be a good mix. I think John Michael's going to make it to the end of cheer class because his sister's like the best cheerleader ever. It's in his blood. I think Adriana's going to make it to the end of cheer class, but I don't know about John Michael. I'm going to be as strict as possible today. There is absolutely zero chance that John Michael or Adriana will make it to the end of this practice. Now that Charlie and Alexa both know I'm doing this on purpose to them, they're probably a little less confused about me getting so mad at John Michael for forgetting his cheer shoes. First challenge, standing tumbling. Wait, are y'all talking? No talking while I'm talking. No, Adriana, please come right here. Please separate. Hi. I got to put y'all between them. We were listening to you guys to you, chatter too much. You guys are too close. No, they were talking too. No, they weren't. I didn't hear anything. This is not cheer practice. This is literally boot camp. Remember, if Adriana or John Michael does not pass each specific round, they will be immediately kicked out of practice. First skill, standing back handspring. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight, sit. One, two. Adriana! <laughs> what are you doing? You literally went after everybody on the wrong count. I don't know how to do a cheer whatever thing. Counts okay, look, look, look. Back. I know this is your first cheerleading class, but you should know how to do counts at least. I mean, that's something you learn in like first grade. Yeah, but I've literally never done no a No talking cheer back. Before. No talking back. Just line up. Did. Line back up. Everybody line back up. This is going to be a long practice. Did I say you could speak? Silent. We're going to do this a second time for people that can't hear that well. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight, sit, one, two. Are you okay? Oh my gosh, you fell down. Is everything fine? John Michael! What were you doing? What do you mean? What were you doing? Your legs were bent. That was so bad. Dude, you can't have bent legs. You know what? Five push-ups right now for bent legs. Go! Go! All five, let's go! Hurry! In order to successfully survive cheer practice, one of them has to secretly pass each challenge in order to move on to the next. But if both of them fail, they'll get kicked out. Next, we're moving on to standing tucks. Why do you look so unhappy? Smile! That's part of cheer! Smile! You look like a dog that's hungry. All right, standing tucks, ready? Five, six, seven, eight, swing, one. Two steps! I saw it! I literally saw it with my own eyes. Stop smiling. Five sit-ups. One, two, three, Yo, okay. four, no need to be five. Aggressive. Well, it's going to help that side of your abs, which was not tight during your tumbling. All right. 
Do you have any advice for him? Maybe 10 sit-ups would help him more than five. Ooh, that's what I was thinking. Why is he being so strict? I do not think John Michael is taking this criticism well. Next, we're gonna do your best standing tumbling skill. And remember, you have to stick it. Time for the best person in the class so far. Are you ready? All right, let's see it. Okay. Oh my gosh, that was so good. That was literally perfect. She stomped that and everything. I hope all of you take notes, especially Adriana Grenet. All right, Adriana. Oh, I got something even cooler. Okay. Oh! Yo! What in the world was that? You cannot land on your bottom in cheerleading. That is a deduction. Deduction in gymnastics too, but I messed up. It was my first one. You know what? You can go right back down to how you were sitting and do 10 sit-ups to make up for the other pod John Michael didn't do. Go. Next, we have Charlie, and no, it's not spelled like Charlie D'Amelio, but let's see your pass. Oh my gosh, that was so good. Did you see that? That's how you're supposed to land a back tuck. Perfectly clean, exactly like she did. I think you should take notes. That was very, very good. And then there was you. Why are you laughing? You know you're not allowed to laugh at cheer practice. No laughing. And no talk. Ready. All right. Gosh. You know what? Maybe cheer is not your thing. You know, your arms are not by your side. You're laughing and you're making excuses. And in competition, they're not going to talk to you. They're just going to write a score down and write you off. Luckily, since John Michael stuck that back tuck, they do pass that challenge and move on to the stunt. For the next challenge, we're gonna be doing stunting. There is absolutely zero talking, unless I point to you. Yes. Does anybody know which leg you fly on? Adriana. Your left leg. Wrong. John Michael. Your right leg. Did I point to you? No, but you called my name. But did I point to you? No, but you called my name. So no. Well, if you think you know everything, why don't you come teach the class? probably will teach it better. Okay, then come up here right now. If you do not hit a toss hand to prep without falling, everyone has to do 10 push-ups. Actually, I changed my mind. Just Adriana. What? You get one chance. All right. Line up, buttercup. All right, let's do it. He better get this. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two. Oh. Yeah! Gosh! Ah, oh, my arm! You're so Sorry, bad. Man. Start your push-ups oh, now. Man. Start your push-ups now. And you do them with her. Oh, Go, do your push-ups too. Wow, that hurts so bad. You're literally not, you shouldn't have even talked. You didn't even know how to do the stunt. I hope y'all didn't take any notes from them because he was not setting a good example of how to stunt. Why do I have to do the push-ups and he didn't do the stunt? Don't ask questions. Sorry, I'm a little big. All right, Miss Alexa, come to the middle. You two are going to base and you're gonna back spot. We are gonna go to a prep. I need straight arms, straight legs and no laughing. You're laughing. Ready, go to smush and go to prep. Feet together at smush, not at prep, at smush. You guys are gonna drop her. Come down, come down, here. What are y'all doing? You almost dropped her. You're so bad at basing, come on. All right, go back, we're gonna do one more. All right, feet together and smush and one, two, dip and go to prep. Much better, high V. Oh my gosh, if all of you could just be like Alexa and stunt perfectly, this class would be a lot easier. That was so fun. Why can't y'all have her main character energy? Better really gauge what was going wrong with that stunt. I really want to get in there myself as a coach and base so I can see what was the weakest link of that. Drop into smush. And one, two, dip, go to prep. Perfect, high V. Oh my gosh, you're literally so good too. Back down to smush. One, two, dip, smush. Ah! Are you good? Come down. You slayed that. You were terrible. Her legs were not even. I could see that she had to stand on a crooked ankle. You're making her job harder. Honestly, I'm thinking about quitting this class, man. This, this, this is bad. I don't know if you're gonna wanna do that. Well, might have to. Guess you're not as strong as your sister. Clearly not. Where's our flyer? Adriana, what are you doing? No eating at practice, Ugh. Crush all your chips up. 
Do you know how much that was? It doesn't even matter. You're not supposed to eat at practice. You have to eat this after practice. I can't. Are you eating too? You know what? You stole my one good right. chip. Y'all no, stop. I stop. don't need to be here anymore. Hey. No, you have to. You guys can't leave practice. 15 second rule. Can't believe y'all did this. You know what? I'm putting this in my cubby for myself later. Adriana is never going to forgive me for crushing her bag of chips. Why are you sweating? You're not even doing anything. Bro, what are you talking about? You're not doing anything. Don't talk to your coach like that. Assume position, ready. Wait, Jack, I've literally never done this before. It doesn't matter. And you're not supposed to eat at practice too, just saying. You didn't eat breakfast. It doesn't matter if you ate breakfast or not. That's not my fault, you woke up late. Ready. That was a good chip though. If you eat during practice too, you're gonna get in trouble. Well, jump in. Put all your weight in our shoulders and lock your legs out. One, two, dip, lock your legs out. Ah, ah, ah. Oh my gosh! She's alive! You How did you fall? Me? Yeah. I said I was gonna drop you as a joke, not fall on me. Adriana, you literally leaned forward. You're supposed to squeeze. You just fell forward. You didn't tell me any of that. You just said go. How am I supposed to know what to do? What? You should know this You're by your first cheer practice. You're Doesn't not matter. You know oh. what? You know what? Go run 10 laps right now while we do the last person. Come on, John Michael. You ready? Y'all think I can throw him? No? I'm a big boy. Hands on the wall and you're not getting arrested. You guys decide if he passes. Ready? And go, jump. Oh, gosh, she's heavy. She's heavy. Oh my gosh. Well, I think I'm doing it. I did better than you. Ah, you're heavy. Oh. All right. All right. Well, I'm confused. I'm confused too. I didn't know what I was. You should have squeezed tighter. But this John Michael pass. Hey, there we go. There we go. Come on, high five. I, I'm like that. It's getting really hard to stay at this practice. The shark is getting stricter and stricter. I've been to a lot of practices in my life, and this is definitely the worst one. This class has been nothing but interesting so far. And to be honest, I think you two have an A plus. But you two have been making so many excuses. And it literally says no excuses on the wall. Practice like a champion. Act. You're not acting. You got to get your act together. Line up over there. We're doing running tumbling. <laughs> oh! Uh, are you laughing at me? Yes, I am. No laughing at your coach. You're not allowed to laugh. Ten push up. Oh, this isn't fair, dude. Oh, what did he do? What do you mean, what did he do? It was funny. You know what? You can join him too. You do 10 push ups. In fact, you have 30. They have so much conditioning, and they're probably so confused right now why I'm going off on them, but not the other two girls. And it's only about to get more intense. Are you almost done? Um, I did 10, but I'm just sticking with her since you want to make her do it. Uh, I'm two more. Two more? All right, good job. You know what? I only counted 28 push-ups. You only did 28, not 30, and you know the consequences for lying. No, I don't. What you do now? You have to go complete the cheer punishment list. If you cannot complete it and come back before the end of practice, you are banned. Anything's better than this. <gasps> she didn't mean that. The cheer punishment list is something that you're only given if you do the worst of the worst at cheer practice. Do back handsprings across a field, spin mystery wheel and do that many toe touches, complete che cheer obstacle course. That actually doesn't sound that bad, but I'm still kind of scared. The worst part is you have to complete all three of the punishments and get back to practice in a certain amount of time, or you get an even worse punishment making it the scariest consequence for misbehaving at practice. Okay, Adriana, your first challenge is to do as many back handsprings down the field as you can. Oh my gosh. Ready, set, go! Adriana just got the cheer punishment, which means she will have to complete three cheer tasks on a list before she can return to practice. And if she does not get back before practice ends, she'll automatically be kicked out. Now that we lost one of the teammates, it's time to do the running tumbling. We'll let you go first, Alexa. Are you ready? Hit the corner. John Michael is definitely not going to make it to the end. So, since you two are doing the first tumbling passes, I actually want you to do your worst tumbling pass on purpose. And I am going to say you guys did perfect just to see how John Michael reacts. Are y'all ready? Let's do this. Woo! 
That was so good. Literally, I don't know how you did that so perfectly. Wait, she had bent legs, I thought. John Michael! No, she didn't. Stop. And you know what? You're last. Go hit the corner now. That was really good. Let's go, Charlie. Whoa! That was so good! Your back tuck was so high. Like, literally, I could have walked underneath that. I could have drove like a school bus underneath that. That was absolutely amazing. Like, honestly. Bro, she didn't even land. What do you mean? She landed on the floor. Yeah, on her knees. But she landed the tumbling pass and she got up with confidence. That was literally so good. I have no idea how you're gonna do something that good. Oh, all right. Yeah, go, hurry. I did that on purpose. You stepped, your shoes are untied. I honestly don't know if that was good enough. What do you mean? You know what? I'm gonna give you one more chance to not step when you land your tumbling pass. Go, again, and hurry. You smell bad. You smell worse. Oh, okay. That was a lot better than the last one, I'll say. It was good. We'll let it slide. You have to spin the wheel and whatever number it lands on is how many toe touches you have to do. Oh my gosh, I hope I get like one. Oh no. Oh, no way, that's oh so my gosh. lucky. Wow. Hurry, you have to get back to the challenge. Okay, go, go, go. Okay. Good thing Jack wasn't here to see that. Let's go to the next challenge. Okay. Good thing I only had to do one toe touch because those back handsprings took a long time. Let's go to the third challenge. The next part of cheer practice is going to be basket tosses. Are y'all ready? Uh. This is also the most scary part of cheerleading, right? Yeah, no? What's your most scary part of cheerleading? Tumbling? Okay, well we're doing baskets now. Y'all can warm up. Right now we are going to test John Michael's basket throwing skills. Now that Adriana's missing, it's up to only John Michael to pass this challenge. And if he can't, practice is over. I don't know why you're laughing. If you don't throw her all the way to the ceiling, you're not strong enough and you're a bad base. And you got it. Ready. One, two, dip, throw. Woo! Oh my gosh! That was, that was so, good. so good, Alexa. John Michael, you're supposed to catch high and absorb. She fell straight onto a hard basket. Do you trust him again? You do? She barely does. Okay, we're gonna do that again. All right. One, two, baby dip, throw. Yes, that was so good for you. I don't know about you though. You didn't even throw her that high, bro. I'm not trying to throw her through the ceiling. Does your stunt group throw you higher than that normally? And they're like half John Michael's size. Hmm. All right, I get it. Maybe you need a little pep talk with yourself. Maybe. Psych, switch. All right, that's her older sister. She's about twice as big. So you gotta throw twice as hard. All right, I got you. Do you think he's gonna throw you harder than her? I don't know. I right, hop in. And one, two, dip. Woo! Good job, Charlie and John Michael. Yeah, I will say, you no, you can't be excited. It was barely better. You it's said barely... to act like a champion. I'm acting like it now, all right? No, I said with your actions, not your talking. But it was higher than her younger sister's basket. So we'll move on. Go, go get some water. All of y'all go get some water. Everyone go get water real quick. John Michael did not drop anyone on their head, so we're gonna let him pass this round. While I was screaming at John Michael, Adriana was somewhere completing the cheer punishment list. Okay, you're gonna have to go through a cheer obstacle course. First off, you only have 20 seconds to complete it. First, you'll have to do a toe touch here. Then, once you're done with that, you'll do another toe touch because cheerleaders do a lot of toe touches. If your time doesn't run up by then, then you have to front walk over across the air track and through the finish line. All of that in 20 seconds? Yes, exactly. Oh my gosh. Are you ready? I guess so. All right, remember, it's only 20 seconds. And three, two, one, go! Rush 
perfect timing. All we have to do is drink water. Practice might have gotten easier since I left. Hey, where's my water? Oh no, buddy. You don't get any. Get back to the floor. Not till practice is over for you. Okay. Are you almost finished with your water? Okay, take your time. Wait, you're back? What are you doing? Get back on the floor. It's time for the final part of the practice. The most important part of cheerleading, the actual cheer and dance. Now, stop. Just stop with that. Like, it, we haven't started. You know what? This is actually going so bad and I can't even watch you two, quite frankly, that I am going to just leave y'all three minutes to practice the same dance and cheer. Then you have to perform it for me at the end. And if you guys do not have it perfectly synchronized, you're all kicked out. Go. What are we supposed to do? Yeah, like what? All right, guys, I have a cheer we can do, but we only have three minutes to learn. I don't okay. know how we're going to learn. Just no, stop. Come on, we need to learn it. All right, yeah, let's go. Charlie began teaching the entire group a cheer, but they were running out of time. So hopefully John Michael and Adriana, who never do cheer dances, can remember this in only three minutes. Jimmy, clap down. Stop! 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 You guys only have 60 seconds to learn this thing and you're a mess! Hurry up! Alright, go, go, go! Five, six, seven, eight, clap, heavy, down, shimmy, clap, down, clean. Okay, and then drop the pom poms, then do a back handspring. Okay. Okay, we need to do it one last time before we perform and we're running out of time. They only had 30 seconds left to practice before they had to perform it, and they only have one chance. Seven, stand, drop. I think it's time to go check in on them and see how they're doing. All right, I'm back, I'm back. I just saw a bunch of ripple effects. I hope that's part of the dance. Everybody line up from the top. You have one try only. I'm gonna count, everybody start from the top, and remember, no redo. In. All of their motions were perfectly synchronized and somehow this came out really good. So even though I'm being the strictest cheer coach in the world, I might have to let them pass this round because they did do really good. My gosh, I am blown away by how good that actually was. You two did perfect and y'all, did good too. I'm honestly a little surprised that y'all did that good. That was awesome. You guys were in sync and that was actually really good. I have no idea how y'all even came up with that. Who came up with that? Charlie. You did? Okay, that's probably why it was so good. Surprisingly, you guys actually passed the challenge. Oh, wait, passed what? What challenge? Oh, uh, yeah, the entire time I was actually secretly judging you. But you guys passed your class. You get a mystery prize. Let's go. Yeah, but what? Hopefully him being that strict was also a prank, but I doubt it. Since you all passed the world's strictest cheer class, you get this mystery prize. Boom, everyone take oh, one. Oh go. my gosh, wow. Let's go. Yeah, isn't it awesome? Oh wait, John Michael. Wait. Ugh, you don't get anything. Subscribe.